Yes. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. It's by on the road during the night time, which means Chester's here. Yeah, because Chester only comes out at night. Yes. We only bring him out at night. Why? <laughs> Answer me. Uh, yeah. Because you're drunk at night, and then I have to drive. Oh, well, always drunk. Usually drunk. I don't know. Ah, uh, drinking and driving, it's no go. Sure it is. No, don't drink and drive. Okay. Have someone drive you around. I'm not drunk now. So there nope. goes that theory. Nope. Still. It's been a while since I had a lot to drink. Hmm. We, yeah, it has. Really? Yeah, it's been like uh, more than a week. Wow. That's a record or something. Well, that's an achievement. <laughs> uh, could be worse. Really? Yeah. Could be drunk every day. That would be worse. Anyway, we'll probably have to detour. Um, really? Oh, we have Just to fill go minutes. left first. Or, you know, the wife will get all uh, suspicious on me. <laughs> oh my god, what are they doing over there? You've saved my can today coming out. Uh, really? That bad, huh? Yeah. Well, it took me to like a wedding wait, reception. Wait, wait, wait. There's. I'm being tailgated. It's not an Audi, people. It has happened. It's an asshole. Yeah, but not now. Usually when I get tailgated, it's one of those. What yeah. is it anyway? It's uh, the Nissan Qashqai. Qashqai, Qashqai, All those faggy jeeps. <laughs> well, there you have it. Not tailgated by a fag. Some frustrated grandpa. Uh. So anyway, you saved my ass because I had to go to a wedding reception. Really? And I hate those things. Because it's... <laughs> Every time, the same old song. Every time. Oh, glad you can make it. So, when it's your turn to get married. Yep. I get that. When are you going to have kids? Ugh. Oh, then you have to beat them with logic. Like, is it a social requirement or something? Uh, if they end up like your kids, I'll probably have to kill them. <laughs> yeah. That'll get them. Conversation ended when they they got mad. Uh, Which means they won't talk to you again. Yeah. They're so dumb they don't get the hint. Well, that's what you get with farmers. Uh, it's not him. No? No, it's, 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 one of those poli it's one of those dudes that went into the politics and now he thinks he owns the world or something. Uh, Douchebag. Yeah, I get that. Oh well. Like a couple of weeks ago, there was like a, how do you call it, a garage sale. Yeah. And my wife wanted to go, a girlfriend, let's call it that, <laughs> wanted to go there. And you know, it's always the same thing. So we're building a house. Oh, wouldn't you want to buy this for your house? Shouldn't you buy that for your house? No thanks, I don't want your dirty old crap. Oh, when he went to the scrap yard. Yep. Damn. Or the dumps. Uh, I was going to say, bring all the crap you can't sell to my place. I'll put it under my driveway. It saves me a dumpster full of dirt. <laughs> uh, Someone told me not to do it. So you didn't. I'll, exp I'll say again. Someone told me not to do it. What do you think I did? <laughs> of course. Made some friends in the neighborhood. Oh, well. At least they know where they stand then. Yep. Good to put boundaries up early. Just like fences. Electric fences. Mm. Barbed wire on it. Yes. Uh, Razor wire. Mm. A mine patch. You know. A moat. Yep. Some crocodiles in it. <laughs> Definitely and, uh, need those. Malaria mosquitoes. Mm. Hard to train those, I think. Yeah. And the way you like bugs? Yeah, not worth the effort. <laughs> Have to wear a hazmat suit to go to your post box. Oh well. 
adds character to the place. Yeah, true, but they do die off during the winter. Yeah, that's true. Then again, you only have to do one year, and I think the message will stick. Yeah, if half the neighbor is dead. Ah. Yeah. A violent outbreak of malaria in Belgium. How the hell did that happen? Mm. It'll plaster my face on news. <laughs> That's the man who hated his neighbors. Killed off half of them. Yep. By accident. Didn't have to go to jail because it was a biological yep. mistake. We had no control over it. How was I supposed to know it would sting people? Maybe we shouldn't have rattled the box when we bought them. I didn't read the tin. I didn't read it. it was malaria on him. Ah. Uh, oh well. Malaria. Now, in all truth, lately, neighbors are starting to turn. Because you fix everything. Yeah, I'm like a, a local hero. My prayer's doing funny stuff. What's it doing? Nothing. And try turning it on. Oh. Oh. Or the cartridges are still in their packaging. Uh, I had that once. <laughs> it's not doing anything. Uh. A few weeks ago, someone complained about his computer constantly falling out. It started, it booted up, and after like two minutes, shut himself down. Yeah. And the man is a bit too cheap to go see like a real certified IT, repair yeah. IT person, man. Yes, those. So they knocked on my door. So I started looking at it, so to see if all the wires are in, okay, everything was good. I was wondering what it could have been. At the end, I decided to take the whole computer apart, so as I did that, the last thing I broke apart was the computer, the cooler, yeah. and the CPU. If you buy a new CPU cooler, there's a thin little plastic on it that says, Peel away before installing. <laughs> Do you know uh, why I know it said peel away before installing? It was still on there. Somebody did not peel away before installing. Just smeared the whole head full of that thermal paste and gooped it on. Well, that's dumb. Yeah, but I mean, for that dumb, you probably didn't do it. It yourself, right? So that means the dude from the store didn't do it either. No, he did it himself. Cable, man cable management also was horrendous. Yeah, well. As in, everything just piled up on each other. <laughs> yeah. Airflow, yeah. A bit like that, a bit like that, yeah. So the crew was like one week old, half the cat was in there. <laughs> I think she was vacuuming the whole house with that thing. Well, they do suck up a lot of dirt and dust, so... But a, a weak old computer shouldn't have that much dust in it. No. I could vacuum my entire house twice, and the bag in my vacuum cleaner wouldn't have nearly as much dust and hair in it as that thing. Oh, well. Keep the IT guys busy. Yeah, and me. Well, you do get paid for it, right? Not yet. It's not like yet. friendly service or something. Uh, not one of those assholes asked me, so how much do I owe you? Well, the good thing is next time they call, you can, I don't know, fudge it up. And what, set the house on fire? Ah, a little less subtle. I mean, pull out a few fans or something. Oh, yeah. And do Linux on it or something. <laughs> What is this? It's new Windows. Yeah. Windows 10. 10. It's a penguin now. Yeah. It's cheaper. Yeah. Ah, oh, well. And I have to fix everything. A couple of months back, I mean, they are like, I don't know how to explain this. The dude bought a new car. Kids Re outside. At this hour. Kill him. Oh, my God. Probably uh, burglars. Yes, they shove in the little ones through the window. Yes. Suspicious hmm. as fuck. Yes, we better call the police. Yes. Have to tease everyone. <laughs> anyway, I'm looking at the time and this is all we have time for. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you're still enjoying the series. Feel free to support by coming, liking, and subbing. If you just come, second, talk about stuff. 
Thank you, Chester, for being here. No problem. Thanks for taking me home. Sure. I'll be seeing you on the next episode. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye.